I'm Julia Piquet and welcome to Motorsport Report. Let's talk about Formula One. Yesterday's Grand Prix at Circuit of the Americas was one of the most exciting races so far this season with some incredible overtakes and battles and of course its fair share of drama after the checkered flag too. Lewis Hamilton lost the lead to title rival Sebastian Vettel at the start of the race, but quickly got back past the Ferrari driver to clinch his ninth win of the season in dominant fashion. With now his fifth United States Grand Prix under his belt, Hamilton edges closer than ever to his fourth Formula One World Championship. Vettel finished second and now trails Hamilton by 66 points with only 75 points left up for grabs. Red Bull's Max Verstappen, who started all the way back in 16th, snatched third from Kimi Raikkonen with a sensational pass on the final lap of the race, but was then given a controversial five-second time penalty for leaving the track and gaining an advantage when completing that pass, which demoted him to fourth and promoted Kimi back to the podium. Mercedes F1 chairman Niki Lauda has labeled the call as the worst decision he has ever seen, saying it's ridiculous to destroy the sport with this type of decision. Lauda recalled that all parties had agreed in a meeting last year to allow drivers to race without unnecessary interference and added that the Verstappen penalty meant the matter would have to be discussed again. Valtteri Bottas finished fifth as his Mercedes team clinched its fourth successive Constructors' Championship with three Grand Prix still remaining. Force India's Esteban Ocon held on to sixth, absorbing late pressure from Carlos Sainz, who scored points on his first race for Renault in seventh. Cyril Abitboul, the team's managing director, labeled science performance as remarkable. That's it for today's news. I'm Julia Piquet, and see you next time on Motorsport Report.